Alright guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 4. And before I say anything, I just wanna quickly, you know, apologize because in the last video I had to add subtitles because my audio was a bit low and you know I'm trying some things out and I had two options either you know completely record the gameplay again or add subtitles. So I mean I did not add subtitles everywhere, I added where I thought I should and I mean, it took a long time to you know edit and stuff so yeah that's that but yeah now that we're in Grand Theft Auto 4 we met a lot of people like Francis McCreary in the last video Playboy X and stuff I, mean, I keep saying this stuff but yeah whatever so what I was trying to say is we met all these characters now that we have met all these characters we have a whole lot more missions to do. We have Playboy X and I think we have Elisabetta and Francis McCreary. That thing, these are the three missions that we have currently. And yeah, we will start you know, doing all those missions one by one. I'm thinking of doing Elisabetta first. And yeah, before we get into the video, if you guys are not subscribed to this channel, please do consider liking this video, subscribing, subscribing to this channel sharing this video it helps the channel grow i mean we our channel is on let's just say our channel you know the subscribers you know, the growth of the subscribers in this channel is a bit slow and i know we can we got we can fix that by i mean you guys have to subscribe and that's i don't know what's happening i'm just stuttering a lot but what i was trying to say is if you guys subscribe we can increase the subscribers and reach the 200 subscribers my goal was to reach you know 200 subscribers by the end of this year but i don't know if that is possible or not with the way a subscriber count is i mean last time i checked i mean i think even the last video was 181 subscribers and it still is hopefully we get more subscribers so if you're watching this video and not subscribe as i said subscribe to the channel like the video share the video even comment like have you felt or there is something that I need to improve myself I will try to slowly improve myself with that and yeah I don't know why I keep stuttering a lot but yeah it's not a good day for me I mean not in a great mood but yeah I think I will be in a better mood if I record for you guys and so here we are and with that being said let's get right in all right uh, here we are so I hope the audio is better now because the last video, yeah, it was pretty bad. And we have our weapons, right? Yep, we do. <clears throat> we have some money and you know what? Francis, huh? Alright. We'll do a mission for Elizabeth. I mean, I feel like that. What happened? Oh, uh, here's the thing, I and mean, you have to hang out with people and shut up. What I was trying to say is when, when, when you are playing a Grand Theft Auto game, one of the biggest things that I wouldn't call it a problem, it's more like when you're forced into you know, going out and doing activities, even though it doesn't do much for the story, then yeah, it just kind of irritates you from time to time, especially when you're playing, especially in this game, like I, I do remember playing this game and while I, do, while I was doing missions, I remember getting calls from Roman just to go out, you know, for bowling or to drink and it just pissed me off. I'm not gonna lie. And who's? I'm robbing you. Don't make me kill you. Hey, anything you say. Shit, we have a message, so Nico thought it might be nice for you to see the place from the good guy's side of the box, Francis. I guess we have a mission from Francis McCreary. What is this? 
hit up purses and Algonquin or all the VIPs go there bro get yourself some freaking blue clothes you're genetically different bro you gotta you gotta got I mean, you gotta get yeah you gotta get the packaging to match that's how you roll all right uh go do missions for her and playboy x i mean we did get missions for playboy x we avoided it just I mean, to find out blood clutch, I forgot to me now, pussy yeah fuck you fucking reggae idiot bitch rondo you want blood clock because i don't even bomb a clock right stop here, speaking you know? that gibberish but bomb a clock pussy old girl you know this Shutting up, bum bum bum. Hey, yo, hey, hey, don't hey, what's this. wrong? What's wrong? Jacob here. You know Jacob? Yeah. Jacob tells me it wasn't him. But some people he introduced me to have ripped me off big time and put the heat on me. I know they all did. Alright, alright, well, alright. So and I'm my fault to the rasta. And I'm my blood well, clap. Not hey, don't come in on my face. All right. You better hope Nico can make this right for you then. Oh, what? Oh, we got a big fucking problem, Rasta. Nico. Go do this fool's job for him! Yeah, I got it. Watch me, I know. See you later. Watch me now. Man. As much as I can't understand what he's trying to say, he is one of my favorite characters in this game. I'm not gonna miss out on, on, on an opportunity to ride this vehicle. Hey, what were we supposed to do? Go to the old hospital and get Elizabeth's... Alright. Not trying to talk during cutscenes because... I don't know, maybe the audio is low. I mean, I'm trying things differently and... Yeah, I mean, I'm trying to do this with one monitor and... Yeah, it's not a... As I say, it's bit of a hectic mess if that's what I have to say I have to go in and out to check whether the audio is okay and stuff I can't do that while recording and so I want you guys to be able to listen to the dialogue so I will try my best not to talk during cutscenes except maybe I might you know and I say something like maybe a reaction, then I might speak, but yeah, that's about it. The fact that I have reached this far in the game without using any cheats, even though I did lose missions from time to time, and that's only going to happen more, but still, the fact that I reached this much is. Uh, well, even a surprise for me. Uh, like every one of you, I, I'm also one of those guys that's that has been waiting for a Grand Theft Auto game like for a long time. Especially with the rise of online games and especially GTA Online. I feel like Rockstar has given less attention to single player games. And they're really good at what they do when it comes to single player games. I wanna know what GTA 6 is all about. I mean it's taking place in Vice City. Or Leonida? Leonida? I don't know how you say it. I just say Leonida. People say Florida, so Leonida. That, that is that how you say? It? Man, sometimes English is just confusing as hell. At least for someone who's not native speaker. All right, we're in the hospital, and I'm supposed to get whatever it is back this is not the oh it's the old hospital all right this, this is going to be a shootout bitch. huh it poured it straight from bolivia manito polvo puro the best man you're an american now the best everything gets made here if the best stuff got made in mexico or colombia or wherever why do you all run across the border tell me that yeah 
Grand Theft Auto as always, a parody of everything. They literally parody everything in these games. And then there's a whole lot of people that think Rockstar is apparently going to go woke or something. Can I use the sniper rifle? Yep, I can see the guy. This. Man, I love this sniper rifle. Feels good to be fucked, it? Especially when you're trying to maintain a distance. Except now, I don't know where these guys are. I can hear these guys, but I don't know where they are. Kill of the day. I'm moving in. So many punks, so few bullets. I'm going in. Holy shit, get down. Yeah, come on, man, come on. Let's waste this punk, man. Oh, now you're scared.
Come on, man. Shoot. Take cover. You're gonna die, motherfucker. Man, I'm reloading. All I gotta do is pull the trigger. Just like in the war. In the last few seconds of your life, come on. Oh, fuck my leg! Okay, okay, don't... Not the cops, man. I mean, this went way better than I expected. I need to get me some sniper rifle ammo. I've got this stuff. You know where the heat is coming from? That thing is really cool useful. But there's one more cat map speak to. Shit! Speaking of fucking cops, I think I have company. I gotta go. Ah, oh, crap. And they have helicopters now? And they have surrounded me.
take cover. Crap. They have shotguns. Now I have to start this mission all over again. One eternity later. Alright, now we did fail the last time, so I was thinking about another way which I took the last time I played this game and I remember this specific mission because I remember losing in this mission multiple times so apparently we were supposed to ouch hey, 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 hey. buddy Ah, uh, crap. It was something like this, I do remember that. Apparently we were supposed to get up. And... Ah, uh, man, it's so difficult to do this in a controller, but apparently you're supposed to go this way. Nah, man. This is going to take a while, is it? Come on, come on. Yes, finally. Yep, this is exactly the way we were looking. Man, I'm going to make a run for it. Crap, crap, crap. Wake up, Nico. Wake up. Go, 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 go. Ah, uh, don't fail this mission, man. Don't fail this mission. I don't want to fail this mission just because I have low health, man. And I have to get out of this zone as fast as I can. Come on, come on. Not like this. Finally. I lost the heat. Where are you? Cheers, Pine. I'm with some buckets and why. Get your no Nico. Let's be some strange shit. Look at the help, man.
Where is this guy? He's on the other side and wait, if I get a train from here. Oh, it's Helito. I guess I'm going to the other side. The fact that we managed to get out of there doing that trick and that do for the the first time we tried it. I know why we were surrounded by the cops, it's because I took a long time to, you know, do that trick, but last time I played I was playing on a keyboard and mouse so it was easy to control Nico. Man, using a gamepad? But I'm glad that it still works. The funniest part is I found out about that trick from a friend of mine who played this game and I was losing this mission, I was not able to win this mission. I remember going to class and I was talking to my friend and he said, oh, you could try this way, there's a bad way, but how to make a climb and so, but you can get out of there pretty fast and get a boat and I remembered while I was, you know, coming back doing this mission, I remember there's something like that. And so I tried. I'll be honest with you guys, if the boat wasn't there, yeah, we would have screwed up. But thankfully there was a boat. And You know there are tricks to Grand Theft Auto missions when they're too tough. It is said that there might be some tricks and stuff that you could pull off just to make the mission a whole lot more easier. This is one of them. Oh man. I don't want to fail this mission at all. Not at this point. No, no, wait. You can't get out of this way? And I can't crawl. Don't tell me I have to find another way to get out. Whoa, that was lucky. Man, I need your car. car I'm sorry. Oh, I don't need the car. Next time, son, I put a blade in you, motherfucker. Finally. Jacob, what are you talking about? You know, I think you're smoking too much. Yo, me think me know the eat I come from in a king. Hey, Nico. Hey, Jacob. What are you doing here? This is no place for you, I Michelle. told you there was something happens, wrong with this woman. You like, see, Nico, I have been working for the is. government. I'm afraid it's my job to watch you. And now I have to ask you for the coke. This is a joke. Right? Please, please don't make this harder for me than it already is. How is it harder Look, for you? They're about to take down Elizabeta. So? I don't fucking believe this. Listen, I'm sorry it had to be this way, Nico. I'm really sorry. Yeah, you are. Hey, you know, you could have gone down too if you weren't so useful. Useful? You fucking bitch. Thank you. Thank you. Nico. Well, uh, you mean to say you're going to let us off just like that? Not now, go on. Well, my employers need the help of a guy like Nico. The office is in Algonquin. I'll call you. 
You know, as in when we need you. Seriously, oh, man. Yes. Yeah, I don't want to swear. Shocking me. I have to tell Elizabeth so she now get her cocky in and out. I knew something like this was gonna happen. The first time I saw her, I felt something was wrong about her. Here's the thing. We need to get something to eat. And also, we need to get... There's the safe house. But here's the thing. Even if the safe house is near, I don't think that they can get anything to eat there or an arm. And we only got this much after doing this mission. I told you, there's nothing here. There's a restaurant. It's a cat break club. Nah. Telling me there's not even a single restaurant here. Yeah, we'll be doing Elizabeth's mission, but. We need to get ourselves together. You know, get some armor and stuff. Here we are. Um, I did, you know, get some armor and health and a bit of ammo for the SMG. Other than that, I did not do anything else. But yeah, another Elizabeth mission. Elizabeth? Beta? Man, this is getting out of control. The police are all over me. I can feel them. So? 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 So I'm gonna go to prison for a long time. <laughs> so my life is over. Oh, God, all this work for nothing, man. Uh, uh, being tough in a man's world. I guess I wasn't so tough, huh? Oh, hey, turn states. Everyone's a rat. Not me. <laughs> Whatever. Open up, man. Who is it? It's the streets, man. Okay, hold on. All right, man. Oh. This is what Manny's oh. all about, man. Manny, 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 Manny. Now, word up, bitch. You better stop slinging that shit on my streets, yo. We don't want it anymore. Hey, OJ, you catching this? Rolling, what rolling. Is this, Manny, for fuck's the sake. The streets have spoken. Now leave my people alone! Are you Nico? What are you doing here? Oh. I knew this was going to happen. This dude wanted fame all the time. I am not in the mood for this right now. Well, well, I said he was going to bust the dealer. Can you help <laughs> me clean this mess up? There's a doctor in Broca who can help. Come on. Let's put him in my car. Doctor? Wait, are we taking these guys to... What I think we're taking me. Hopefully, we're taking these guys to the place where the dead go after they die. Sorry, officer, sorry. Crap, these guys, man. I swear to God. Oh. Come on, man. Yep. Now, where am I supposed to go? Alright, what's up? We're supposed to get into the highway. Alright. And GTA 4 is one of those games that, even though it is dark, it has its own moments. I mean, I feel like this is the most, I mean, darkest Grand Theft Auto game that I have played. I have played almost all of the Grand Theft Auto games, except maybe for games like Chinatown Wars and stuff. 
think I haven't played Chinatown Wars and GTA Advance. Other than that, I have played most of the Grand Theft Auto games. Have a nice day. And the thing is, out of all those games that I have played, this is the game with the most darkest, you know, atmosphere, tone and stuff. I keep saying stuff, but... Shit, Jacob, I'm sorry. I'm already hanging out with two friends. I've kind of got my hands full looking after them. Uh, we should do something soon, though. Thank God we're in the middle of a mission. This is what I was talking about, like, I've already gotten like five or six calls right now from Little, J I mean not Little Jacob, it's more of Roman and Brucey. They keep call. wait, why are we in an alleyway? I don't remember this. I've got some bodies in here. I've heard you'll take care of them. Uh, natural causes? Of course. Seems like a bullet in the head is as natural as it gets in this town. They weren't sick, were they? No. Had a few problems with sick bodies. No one wants a liver if it's riddled with tumors, huh? Know what oh I mean? Oh my god. Shit. Looks like the bullet went right through this one's eye. And the price of eyes is through the roof at the moment. <sighs> Fine. Can I leave you with these or what? Sure. I'll have these organs out on the street in no time. They're gonna help a lot of folks. He'd been trying to help the streets his whole life. Maybe he'll actually be doing it now. He's a... I don't think he's a good doctor. I'm, I know that... I know that people donate their organs and stuff after the, their, you know, demise or death or whatever you say. The doctor has that stuff. God, one last thing to bother me. The heat is closing in, Nico. This particular party is ending. Yeah, I guess that's that for Elisabetta. I'm not gonna drive all the way, man. I'm just gonna go to Playboy X. So where to? I want to go to uh, Zeno Time Street. Okay then. Zeno Time. I mean, what I was trying to say was, Here we uh, are, I mean, then. trying to say earlier was, there's people who donate their organs willingly, and I don't think this is anything that he's doing willingly. I think it's more of an illegal stuff, and. Playboy X. Alright, who's this? Nico, it's Patrick McCreary. Oh. You and me did some work for Elizabeth Torres together? You mean I saved your ass? Well, <laughs> if I'd have known it was such a big deal to you, I would have asked you to let them kill me. Anyway, if you're in need of extra funds, I'm in need of a good man. Come over to Mama's on Savannah Avenue in Meadows Park. I'm always in need of money. See you there. We have Packy. Leave construction for big beginners. Hey, what's up, money? Hey, come on, ladies, give me a few minutes. Business calls. <laughs> this All right. my town. Look at it. All them tiny ants down there. Man, shit is crazy. So I guess you do okay. Yeah, okay. But, uh, what about you? What motivates you? Hmm. Well, I need money. This pays. I can do it. I don't care if I live or die. And I'm looking for someone. Someone special? Yeah, you could say that. So, why do you need me? Well, I'm always looking for good guys. Build an army. But in my work? People change. Money changes people, not me. Now I'm still a hustler from these streets. 
And I heard good things about you. Okay, but I'm warning you. I'm not low budget. <laughs> <laughs> Do I look like I live low budget, dog? Yo, player. Fuck you want. There's someone here for you. Dwayne or some shit. I don't know. Dwayne. Damn. My dude. What's up, son? What's going down? You didn't tell me you was getting out, man. I, I would have laid on a party, got some freaks out. Jeez. I called a couple of times. Man, hey, Dwayne, uh, this is Nico. Hey. Nico Dwayne Ford taught me everything I know. Oh, he's the Not guy everything. that Playboy was talking so, about hey, in man, the last what episode. You, what you need some money? What's the plan? What you mean, what's the plan? Pick up where we left off. I'm out, I'm back. We keep on rolling. You say we? Yeah, we. Unless you too fine. What, your silk sheet? Fancy dress wearing life too big for me now? Oh, hey, now, I ain't saying that. You know what's mine's is yours. You need help, just holler. Hell, this Slavic motherfucker ain't any good. He can help you. And you know I do anything I can. Uh, but right now, we gotta roll. Give me one second. Ain't folk quick to forget. Hmm. Some folk. Yeah, that's the truth. Where did you get out from? Preschool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dwayne, we got a roll. Please make yourself at home. Hell. This is your home. This jet money. Yeah, I don't believe this Playboy oh, guy. Think I'm an idiot. Here's the thing. I understand if going to Castle Gardens. There's an alley we want to hit up just off the South Parkway. I understand if he. What I'm trying to say is I'm stuttering a lot, but. What I'm trying to say is, I understand if Playboy doesn't want to go back to what they were doing, and if going back wants to, some people are stubborn, and instead of, they just want to keep doing what they do, instead, like, if they get a good life, they could, you know, lead a good life, but they don't want that life, they just want to keep doing what they do. I don't know if this makes any sense, let's just say, if you remember San Andreas, Sweet is one of those characters who just wants to go back to the hood and, you know, Grove Street and live that life while CJ is basically trying to make an empire of his, of his own. And it is the same thing here, but the thing is, Playboy, I mean, it's not, I mean, completely the same thing, but I feel like Playboy is not happy that Dwayne is back because, I don't know. All right. You heard of Yusef Amir? Big real estate developer? I don't know. I've heard a lot. One thing I can say is I don't believe Playboy. Like, from the get-go, I did not believe him. I mean, I don't think he's a good guy. I mean, this no guy's one is a, a big good guy. Developer? I'm pausing again and again, but no one is a good guy. And this dude doesn't... I don't think... I mean, what I'm trying to say is his kind of... For me, I feel like he's more of a villain. He's not a good guy in this game you know we are a good guy in this game but we're also a bad guy he is a bad guy bad guy we're a good guy bad guy i don't know if that makes sense i'm saying something stupid right now you and him having meetings about how to run the city you know let's just play Not the yet, game but i got an idea about how me and him can get friendly some italian dudes shut down his building site on some union bullshit. they all up in the place strapped to their fronts with hard hats on and shit. Won't let nobody get near me. What are you suggesting we do about it? You gonna go in there and get them mafia types off the site. Meantime, I'm gonna tell Yusuf how good we've been to him. That cat and me is gonna be tied as two cellmates on lockdown after this. What's in it for me? I'll give you what you after. Cold, hard cash. That what you're chasing, right? Amongst other things. I don't know how good your plan is, though, Playboy. If I get rid of the guys on the site, then won't there be more? If it's a union problem, doesn't that make it bigger than a few guys with guns? Shit. Union is just another word for mafia. These cats is looking to squeeze our boy Amir for dollars just because he ain't from here. When we fuck their people up, they'll realize that he ain't a cat to be messed with. 
nail back off. Okay. Shit. Youssef is from Dubai. He's an African, and he's coming to Liberty City to make it big. It's my duty to watch this cat's back. My ancestors came from Africa. Now he's coming out a bit later. Me and him could be cousin shit. I think you might want to look at the map, Playboy. Dubai isn't in Africa. Shit, it all the same. Africa, America, Dubai. It don't matter. We're brothers. Spiritually, I mean. And that's the important bit. Dubai, huh? Well, I was... I grew up, you know, some years in Dubai. Before I came back to India. And there's a whole lot of memories that if I do a video just based on what I remember, all the cartoons, animes, and video games that I have played, I, can't, I don't think I'll be able to do it in one video. There's a whole lot of stuff that I have, I will have to talk about. I left some heat for you in that car, money. You're gonna be strapped. Sniper rifles, grenades, all that shit. We're getting grenades. I mean, we're getting sniper rifles, that's all we need. Yo, there's three lookout cats making sure no one makes move on the site. You best take them out with the rifle before you hit up the rest of them. I'm gonna get in the position where I can see all the shit going down. If you can take out the main cats, then the rest of them shouldn't be a problem. When you in there, I'll give you the lowdown on where these main cats is at. You might be better seeing the lookouts from up here too, money. Shit. I needed to find a cat like you. A badass motherfucker who ain't afraid to take fools down. Yeah, well, I need money, so you're in luck. You're gonna kick some ass down there, boy. I'm backing you up. Uh... Ouch. It's not even ouch. Ooh, that must have hurt a lot. I'm sorry, buddy. Where's the other guy? Man, where is this last dude? Oh, there he is. I couldn't see him from here, but now I see him. That all them lookouts gone, buddy. Get in there and free up the site. Later on, if you. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I just want to get in there and make shit happen. Go to the construction site and find the first union leader. Or the mafia leader. I just want to bring that. The first guy is on the scaffolding in the building to the east of the yard. Oh, I see him. Oh, motherfucker. Next guy is south of your position, up a few stories in the next building. Do you, you 
all bent over because of you! Uh, right. I hope we're going the right way. I don't want to mess this up. Crap. Ah, oh, crap. Look around. You're surrounded. <laughs> Where is this dude speaking from? Get at him. You know what? All right. There's a ladder in here. Crap, 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 crap. And we're back. We're climbing the ladder again. And I'm not gonna make the same mistake again. Hopefully.
Man, I don't want to fall off. But I do want to get to the other side. So I'm going to walk by the edges. I see him. Ah, oh, crap. All right, I guess we're going back Not to the safe route. I don't want to fall off. Please don't, please don't. Holy. This is a union matter. Get fucked. There ain't no fucking way out of this now, you son of a bitch. You scam.
man such as me. I got rid of all the union problems on this site. As you can see, this place is going to need a cleanup before any workers come in. You the money, son. You said PA won't put me through to the cat. But when they hear about this shit, they're gonna start listening to Playboy. Hey, watch it. Finally. We need to stock up. And... Get some health, armor. There's a whole lot of stuff we have to do. Hold up, shoot. I so, think we would buddy. do this mission. Not much. How are you? Chilling. It's all good. Well, mostly good. Mostly? Yeah. Dwayne's been getting on my nerves. Pushing me, man. But whatever. We spoke about that shit already. Uh, give him time. He's just out of prison. <laughs> For real. Listen, G. Dwayne ain't the only thing I got on my mind. No? No. Some motherfucker's been calling me a phony. Calling me a snitch. Calling me all kinds of bullshit. Big deal. Yeah, big deal. Damn right. Until I discover that same motherfucker. Well, he's got some real loose lips. Not bad. So, you'll need this guy silenced? Yeah. He hangs out with his team near the courts on Exeter between X and W. Okay. What does he look like? Well, son ain't too diesel or nothing. And he a regular looking dude, know what I mean? Now, he don't flash his guap too much, but you can see it in his eye. He a hustler. Eh? <sighs> Homie ain't too brolic, but he ain't scrawny neither. And he be styling on him a little, you dig? I mean, he ain't too bummy, but he grimy too. So, he's the average one? Look, he's brown skin, B. Motherfucker be rocking baggy clothes, all that. Jewels, and he stay fresh with the clean sneakers. Know what I mean? And sometimes a bandana. Look, I need more than that to go on. Jesus. Here, take this. Head down there. Take a photo. Send it to me. And I'll point out which one of them motherfuckers it is. Fine. And that's a little <laughs> gift for you. Well, I think that's our new phone. It's a good thing we have a new phone. As I was trying to say, we would do this mission and we will end the episode here. I don't know that this episode is going to be long or short, but whatever it is. And at this episode, we will end it. This episode. And that's why the penetrators ain't doing nothing this season. They got no one who can work the lanes, man. Shit, Lieutenant. That's something I was forced into from the necessity of my financial situation. My body is forced to rob and deal in order to sustain my own well being and that of my immediate family. Man, it's raining and I can't even see properly.
I don't even know what I'm doing at this point. I'm trying to take it from outside because I don't want to fail the mission. This isn't it, right? The camera call is bad, so... We will stay here. So I think that one of those guys is And I've been sending photos for a while. Do I have to take a close-up of that photo, or should I just take every single one of them out at this point? Yo, money. Marlon's the one in the black jacket. He was smoking. Sure. Come on, come on. Well, we took it out. It was easier than I expected, so happy that I didn't have to chase him around for a long time. Marlin is dead. You the man, son. You money. You my ice cold Slavic killer. See you soon.
and I guess we will end the episode here. That's it for today's episode, guys. And I know we did, you know, uh, two or three missions in this episode. I kept failing to I mean I failed the first mission a few times, but and you know one of those Playboy access missions. But yeah, we pulled pull through and. We have we have missions of Playboy X, Francis McCreary, Patrick McCreary, doing. We have still missions left to do. So this is this series is going to be a long one because hey, it's Grand Theft Auto. It's going to take a while. I mean, we can't finish the game just like we did Batman Arkham series or any other games. This is not just a linear game. Eh? This is Grand Theft Auto. This is my first time playing without any cheat codes or stuff. So. That is going to take a while. But yeah, with that, with that being said, if you guys are not subscribed, as I said in the beginning of this video, please do consider subscribing to this channel, liking this video, sharing this video, as it helps the channel grow. Our goal, as I said, our goal was to reach 200 subscribers by the end of this month, but, but I don't know whether it's going to work out or not. Hopefully it does, but even if that's not the case, I'm fine. I mean, I have you guys, so that's what I'm, what I'm saying. If you guys are watching this video and not subscribed, all you have to do is subscribe and like this video. It's not a big, it's not something that's gonna take a whole long time, all right? And yeah. With that being said, I hope you all have a great day, and I hope to see you all in the next video. Until then, take care.